Yo what is up guys, welcome to my new video. In this video, I'll be showing you how to obtain the power building in Lambert Tycoon 2. Easy building, also called the power building, is a feature that was added in September 2017. Now you're wondering what does it do? It changes the amount of food required for blueprints. As you can see, different blueprints require different amounts of wood in order to fill them up. For larger blueprints, you would need more wood, obviously. With easy building, any blueprint in the game requires only one unit of any wood. The effect applies to the wood, not the blueprints themselves. So, if a player were to use one unit of wood that is owned by a player who has obtained easy building, the blueprint would fill up instantly. With that being said, let's get straight to the tutorial on how to obtain the easy building. First of all, before anything, you will need to have $10,009,000 in order to obtain it. If you used to play the game a lot before like I did years ago, you would have earned it by putting a lot of hours into the game. By the way, the easy building is also purchasable as a game pass in Roblox and it costs 720 Robux. To be able to glitch through the wall where you can obtain easy building, you will need to go with this car. First of all, you have to purchase one dynamite at Bob's Shack. This is the fastest method and all you need to have is this tiny floor blueprint which you can buy over here at Wood R Us. Now, head to the fallen boulders towards Taiga. Put the dynamite in the middle of the boulders to clear the map. Once you did that, go to the left and position your car like I did. It doesn't have to be perfect, but try to put it in the same place like I did. Now, jump out of your car and pull out your blueprint. Once you did that, get in the car again and put your small floor blueprint on the back of the car like shown. Now, keep pressing T or R buttons until the glitch works. And just like that, you glitch through the wall. Now, there will be a character named Strange Man over here. All you have to do is interact with him. He will take the money away from you and give you the power. That is it. Now you can go and reload your slot. As you can see, the floor on the plot looks a bit different than it used to. It has a yellowish texture now. Also, your blueprint page has changed the color from blue to yellow. And that is it, that was the whole tutorial. As you can see, I'm back on my new main slot and the power build doesn't transfer in between of slots. If you wanna do that, I'm pretty sure you have to buy the game pass. Let me know down in the comments if this video helped you and if you learned something new from it. Thanks for watching the video, next video will be out on Friday at 5pm, so stay tuned. See you in the next one and until then, peace.